when manzoor was at the height of his activities of you know mischief mongering against ahmadiyya and there also immediately after after mubala a crop of ulama rose up to steal the limelight by challenging me the most prominent among them was munir mustinoti of course and the second came a newly new star rising whose name was the manazil quran wala Mawlana Tahir al-Khadri, now he has established many missions all over the world, you know, he was a rising star among them. So he held a great drama and it was said that by the, close to the minaret of Pakistan, more than a hundred thousand people gathered, some said three hundred thousand. He said, I am, I have come here and I will wait all night for Mr. Tahir Ahmed. I am here to accept his challenge. and the drama was played and everybody came and enjoyed and did this and that but no mubala was even mentioned there you see he was inside he was afraid but he made a lot of propaganda and won the public acclaim because of the publication of that so called mubala in the newspapers next morning so these were the two most prominent members from pakistan who seemed to rise in fame in having the you know the boldness and character to accept my challenge and bring me bring me low in the sight of the people i when i prayed i said of course i have thrown challenge because i fully believe support from you o allah but i want to see some signs about these people some definite information that what would happen to them and i saw in a dream two dogs coming close i'm sitting and they come close and sniffing you know and one of what i do is i take in my hand a shoe of the punjab old you know oriental style we call it juti you know like perhaps mm. you also wore in arabia, in arabia. <laughs> hmm? and it's a longish shoe and i start sight and i start striking at the face of one dog which is behind first at his face i do it twice one on this side one on the other and he mm-hmm. runs away and there's one left he just won't leave and i keep striking at him with the, that shoe that oriental type of shoe first on this side then on the other and then and his face gets elongated with the Be- repeated beatings and then the face looks like a shoe <laughs> it ends up like this the whole face is that of a shoe and then i leave the dog alone so i told i think i mentioned it in juma or, or not but i mentioned it to many of amadis here and i might have mentioned it in my jalsa session i think find out but i did tell everybody that according to my interpretation The first one who has receded and left us alone is Tahir al-Qadri. And the second, because they were the two main people in my mind. And the second is Manur Chinyoti. He will not die, but he will come to such thorough threshing by Allah that he'll end up like a man with a dog's face on his head. So Tahir al-Qadri, look at what had happened to him. he rose to a very rapid fame after this because till that time he was a favorite of nawaz sharif who was very powerful minister of the punjab chief minister of the punjab somehow again you know these things go to the mullah's head they think it's we who have become powerful so he fell foul of, of nawaz sharif and he said all right i'll tell you where you belong he did things to him whereby he was reduced and charges were pressed against him and he was dragged into the court for uh, fun, what, what was it I mean, charges of financial irregularities or fraudulent eh? fraudulent case fraudulent sense something i mean i don't remember the detail 
that but uh, he was brought to the court and there he repeatedly was questioned by the lawyers from the government side and other lawyers also came in from representing different mm -hmm. groups and there it was specifically inquired from him did you or did not throw did you or did you not accept the challenge of mubala of mr tahirman he said no i didn't <laughs> and believe that it isn't it but it happened in the court in the court is published statement in the court no no i never did what was the drama that was published so all over the world in the paper in all papers belonging to pakistan and maybe it also it was covered by arab papers so it's a big noise in there she no 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 it was in said no you did said no 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 i never accepted so this is how allah fulfilled the first part of a dream the dog behind has only two <laughs> strokes of this shoe and it recedes so the dog in front is still alive <laughs> Excuse me, I want to tell the yes, first, yes, the yes. first one. Yes, yes. <laughs> and he said, even if he doesn't come by the morning, curse of Allah will befall him. Nawaz Sharif, Nawaz Sharif, now. Nawaz Sharif, now. Prime Minister, now. Well, Pakistan. Nawaz Pakistan. First, first, Pakistan. at that time he was a Reis of Punjab. Yes. Then he rose to the yes to become the Prime Minister of Pakistan. Now. And before that, these were the two you know, who went hand in hand in concocting lies against the against the people of Allah. So this man is a no teller of truth either. But sometimes a big liar also tells the truth. This is true. The only truth, perhaps, he has spoken in all his life.